Welcome back. Another step forward in the future of flight as Silicon Valley company received special approval from the, fe from the federal government to put its flying electric cars to the test in the skies. National correspondent James Packard has the high flying details from California. Now, Silicon Valley based Aleph Aeronautics is one step closer to having the first electric flying car on the roads and in the air. This after the company was granted a special certification from the Federal Aviation Administration to test its products in the skies. With this certification, we can actually fly close to home for different kind of purposes. Jim Duchovny is one of the founders of the Northern California based sustainable electric transportation company. He says the special government certification gives his company clearance to operate its Model A flying car over parts of Silicon Valley. An electric vehicle capable of driving on roads like an automobile or zooming up like a vertical takeoff and landing aircraft. He says it's the first vehicle of its kind to receive such a clearance for test runs from the federal government. I would claim it actually to be the first traditional car and especially an electric car. Looks like a car, can be parked in a parking space, um, can be driven on a regular street with vertical takeoff, which is allowed by the government to fly. It's maybe a very small step for plane. It's a giant step for cars. Aleph unveiled the full-size sports model car in October 2022, along with two working full-size demonstrator cars. As for concerns about safety, it's safer than helicopters and airplanes and safer than your regular cars on the ground. The company says it plans to begin delivering the vehicles to customers by 2025. With the help of the federal government, they're one step closer to getting that goal off the ground. With the modern technology, you should not be standing in traffic, wasting your time, wasting everybody's time and so on. Time is very precious. James Packard, Scripps News, Los Angeles. first drive plus vertical takeoff vehicle in history. 